Hey guys, welcome back to another video and I'm in seven days to die again. This is Alpha 19 and the beginning of a new series. And what I thought would be cool is if we had a look at some of the buildings and explore them and see what they have to offer. You know, buildings of note or interest. And this one here, you know, on the face of it, you wouldn't think this would have any interest whatsoever it's a small kind of I don't know holiday villa potentially townhouse it feels a bit out of place in the city but I think randomly they spawn anywhere so what we're going to do is we're going to have a look inside and see what this has got to offer because this has a secret this building let me just get, get a, another picture from this angle so you can see it's got these brown walls and these flower pots outside. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in and have a look. I've got a shotgun to help us clear this out. And we're going to go in here. Smash the door down. Oh, I'm a bit hungry. Okay, so we've got a standard room here. Right now, zombies can come out. This, these ones are actually a bit of a pain. I find she gets pretty quick. You can get a headshot up close. You'll do it. It's pretty nerve-wracking, actually. These zombies. This game is so scary. Right behind some of these picture frames, there may well be some hidden compartments. Always check those. There you go. Not really much there. Let's see what we've got here. Let's get a little bit of space here. We've got some zombies coming in from outside. These ones can be pretty dangerous. There we go. Got to get those headshots. Right, kitchen. Got all your standard stuff in here. If I find anything of use, I will show you. There's a lot of stuff to scrap. Some food, maybe. We've got some interest from outside. Another one. Here he comes. Tripping up the curb. Mustn't forget to reload as well. Sometimes you forget to reload in the heat of the moment. All right, so we've got, let me just check the inventory there. We've got, um, I'll scrap those. I'm gonna scrap quite a lot. This stuff I've got already. Maybe use some stuff, create some space. Scrap that. I don't really need the sewing kits. All right. Uh, picture up here. I don't think there's anything in this one. Nothing down there. Your standard bathroom. Maybe some water, murky water in there. All right. Let's go further into the house. Now this is. All right. Ah, here's further in. Okay. So, barrels aren't bad. If you want murky water, they are brand new for that in this edition. Right. Right. We've got a basement here. Now, you can see over there, look, there's a door. The secret underground vault in this particular house. It's quite extensive. These guys give it away. I will come back and loot these actually. I don't need I don't need to gather all the water up yet. You can see there's there's cement here as well, which are cobblestones which I will loot. I'm gonna need to just loot this one because I'm gonna take this one out. 
barrel so we can get to this vault. These are all unlocked. I've actually been through one of these houses before. Let's just eat some food quickly. All right, so there are zombies behind these. Let's have a look. I've got that's right. So this is a good sign. Got more stuff, more cobblestone to loot there, which is very handy. And we've got a vault door leading down. Very much a larger underground base here. You can tell because it's leading down. Wow, it's a series of rooms, safe rooms, another one, and you can see there's some kind of control panel down here in this section. Right, we've got Shush your head. Right, we've got four radioactive zombies down here. In fact, they're not radioactive, they're the hazmat zombies. Now you see, that's interesting. That shot took out two. You see that? Two headshots at the same time. Right, lots of bodies. You can loot the bodies for rotten flesh and bones, I think. Right, we've got one, two there. Uh, there's another space down this way. Let's open. Uh, that's the way we. Now that leads around to the little control room. And another way in there. I don't think we're going to worry too much about that at the moment. Not a lot of looting so far in those zones. All right, let's let's go and check out this area. Here. It looks like a well-equipped base. Shotgun ready. Locked. Okay. We can take this down with the pick. Okay, so the door's nearly broken through now. Let's get the shotgun ready. I think there's maybe three zombies behind this location. Maybe. Maybe two. Is some kind of barracks, maybe, or bedroom. It's full of bunks. Nothing much here. Toilet, okay. Right, we've got a med cabinet. Handy, first aid kit, that's not bad at all. Ooh, a little knife in there. That's quite nifty. Don't leave any behind here. No. Nope. Let's get rid of that grass there. Scrap that. That knife's not bad. What else have we got here? So this has slept quite a few people. Right, corridor. Let's see back into the hallway there. Alright, so this looks like the loot room. The main loot room. It's going to be zombies in here. Military zombies. Okay. Oh, what's that one? Try and get one on a straight line. So it's better that way. How many is it going to take? Just two. He just tripped into the hallway there, down there. They both took damage there. Here we go. Nice. <laughs> Anybody else in here? Doesn't look like it. Right, so there's quite a bit of loot. There's medical supplies, desks. Trash, more medical supplies, lab equipment, acid, more acid. In fact, that looks like it's spread out. That was a schematic in there, not bad. We've got these bigger crates here, we'll check those in a sec. 
More medical supplies. Not great loot. Incidentally, I think I'm lucky looter level 3. You can see the types of stuff I'm getting. Alright. Now for the main stuff. It's, un it's untouched. Good. Let's check this one here. Reinforced. Right. Lots of stuff. Okay. That's water purification mod, which is great. Get that. Um, iron leg armor, gold nuggets, silver nuggets, we've got pipe bombs, okay, not bad at all. Let me just use some of this stuff, it's often the case, we get bits and pieces like this, we don't need the rag, don't want the golden rod, we'll keep glue, the iron legs, I'm going to scrap those. For the moment, don't need those. Don't need the crossbow bolts. Um, we don't need the oil shale at the moment. Scrap that. Um, what else? We don't need the the blood bags. Got loads of those back in the house. Um, scrap the can. Use the soup. We've got an extra grain alcohol there. We'll get rid of that and scrap. Just to clear space in my inventory. There's going to be fair amount more I think. Right, let's have a look at these crates. Smash them open. Not great. Shotgun Messiah sealed shipping crate. Uh, oh, some more ammo there. That's handy. And some parts. Shamway sealed shipping crate. Food. Uh, one thing of honey. Which... Um, we we'll use now. We don't want the dye. I'm gonna keep the acid. We've got gun parts. What else have we got in here? We're not encumbered as yet. Let's scrap that axe. Okay. Right. Well, we'll, we'll come back for all the other bits and pieces. That is locked. All right. From the sounds of it, got some more zombies somewhere. Where are they though? Right, so that was that side. That took us through to the main looting room behind these. It's a well-equipped base, isn't it? What have we got down here? Wakey, wakey. Got a nice straight line. Oh, she's fallen down. Got zombies falling down from above. So obviously there's a level up there we haven't explored yet. Maybe this will take us there. Right, there's some bits and pieces behind here. Just actually some medical supplies. 20 jars. There's a passage here. That obviously leads through to other space there. Just want to check these. They're wood. Don't look like wood, they're like metal to me. No, nothing here. Well. Looking down into that main space. Where are they? they? Must be in here. Oh! Oh my god. Anybody behind me? No. Whoa, that was close. She's quick. It's that angle that does it. If you don't get it straightened up, it can be very tricky. That was my last buck there. Right, anybody else in this room? Okay. It's a kind of mess hall, kitchen area. Lots of the cupboards are open, so... I'm not getting huge loot from these. That's better. What have we got? Uh, more cans. Search the trash. Not bad. I'll come back and get those. Um, we've got more medical supplies. Quite a lot of med medical supplies in this. But that is the space we were in before. The sleeping courses. Uh, 
and then this just that is basically this space here let's try and get into this space right, here we are ah I don't think we've been here have we been here before there's a backpack not great let's just uh, throw the die I don't want the die use the pears um, scrap the cans iron arrows don't worry so much about those at the moment we'll get rid of the just those nails okay where are we here did we come in here we must have done yeah this was okay this was that first one we came into that had the ladder there and you could jump across there and carry on through to the other space probably a way of avoiding the locked door okay awesome so this was the way in it done that space and that space this one down here was the bathroom and then through here was the main loot room there and here it's pretty actually that is really worthwhile there's some pretty good looting going on in that space and then this leads us back out and up to here Let's just get rid of this get out and there we go so that as a building is uh, unsuspecting you know you just don't quite realize that below this is that massive complex and some pretty good loot so guys that is the first little building exploration video that I'm doing there are some others with some great um, underground bases which we should explore uh, those include the uh, graveyards which we're gonna have a look at next so I hope you enjoyed the video if you did click the thumbs up if you want more content like this then let me know below it's always difficult to tell whether you just want sort of gameplay like this with a bit of um, guides incorporated into it or you want the straight instructional videos just let me know what you feel about that and um, I'll see you in the next video guys thanks for watching